let me let me just say say this. And I wish we had 400 people here. I really do, because I wish to goodness that they could hear. I wish we had 400,000 or 4 million, because I, I'd love them to hear me just say just these words. We've got the expertise right here to be able to fix it. We've got the expertise. Now, unfortunately, this is a problem that's going to take a lot of money. It's just going to take a lot of money. And so we've got the expertise that's going to try to put us on a pathway with pilot projects that will put us on a pathway to give us a, to give us a formula to fix it, you know. Now, and the formula can be lots and lots of different directions. But the other thing is just this. Be me just a minute. Be me and say, okay, today we've got more jobs in the state and we've got people that can fill the jobs. Today we're actually building roads and trying to fix the roads so you can go to the convenience store. And today we're making a real life commitment to education in our state and we've done the same thing with our veterans. And like it or not like it, today the numbers and the monies that are coming into our state are pretty dang gum good. There's one other thing. There's one other thing that's absolutely holding us back in every way. And that's what we're here to do right now. And that's this drug situation that's absolutely difficult to drag. Now, be me. I came in and really and truly what we had to do was we had to get jobs and we had to get roads and we had to get education and we had to get our vets and we had to get our economy moving in the right way where we have dollars. But we've still got to get this. And this is really, really important. 